Jerry Meinwald, one of the founding fathers of chemical ecology, would have turned 96 today. Born in New York City on January 16, 1927, Jerry served in the U.S. Navy as an electronics technician, 1945-46, earned a Ph.B., 1947, and B.S., 1948, in chemistry at the University of Chicago and the M.A., 1950, and Ph.D., 1952, at Harvard. He started his career at Cornell as a DuPont postdoctoral fellow and instructor, 1952-1954, and then as assistant professor, 1954-1958. Except for a brief hiatus when he joined the faculty at the University of California San Diego, 1972-73, he remained at Cornell throughout his career. He was named Goldwyn Smith Professor of Chemistry, 1980-2005, and Goldwyn Smith Emeritus Professor of Chemistry since 2006. He published his first paper in Chemical Ecology in 1954, The Degradation of Nepetalactone. Jerry produced more than 400 peer-reviewed articles with some 200 collaborators. His last paper was a review article in ACS Omega, Molecules as Biotic Messengers, published 13 days before he passed. In an email to his co-authors, Jerry wrote on March 19, 2018. Dear Julia and Walter, What good news that our perspective is doing well. The timing is perfect, this should turn out to be my last paper. Health problems are now depleting all my energy. Very many thanks to both of you for taking care of any remaining details. Sincerely yours, Jerry. Jerry was a charismatic speaker. Thank you, Ray, for that lovely introduction. When, since I've known May since she was a graduate student, I couldn't possibly find an invitation to come and speak to you today. Uh, I had no particular idea what in the world I might have to say. Uh, and here we have a large number of dedicated chemical ecologists hoping to hear something interesting. And I congratulate you all for appearing at 8 o'clock in the morning. Uh, congratulate myself for being awake at 8 o'clock in the morning. And I thought, well, if we're going to talk about the history of chemical ecology, we might as well begin at the beginning. And uh, I've always wondered, since chemical ecology deals with uh, the chemical interactions between organisms and nature, uh, I thought it would be interesting to spend five minutes reviewing where do our chemicals actually come from. On the occasion of Jerry's 90th birthday celebrations, the president of National Academy of Sciences, Dr. Marsha McNutt, lauded Jerry for his outstanding services as a member of the editorial board of PNAS. I think you know, Jerry, that your heart and soul really went in to the proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences. As a member of the editorial board, you have personally overseen 569 manuscripts to date. That is a remarkable achievement. But not only have you been a member of the editorial board, you have been one of our outstanding authors. I was noting that of your most highly cited papers, quite a number of them were published in the proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences. And for that, we thank you. Jerry's research was nationally and internationally recognized. In 2014, President Obama presented Mindwall the 2012 National Medal of Science. National Medal of Science II, Gerald Meinwald, Cornell University, for applying chemical principles and techniques to studies of plant and insect defense and communication, and for his seminal role in establishing chemical ecology as a core discipline important to agriculture, forestry, medicine, and environmental science. At the 38th Annual Conference of the International Society of Chemical Ecology in July this year in Bangalore, India, Jerry Meinwald will be memorialized by Professor John Pickett, Cardiff University. We miss you, Jerry.